as the droids begin their autonomous time. Their goal is to put power cells into the power ports. Upper power port, higher hexagon shape, the outer power port. During autonomous times, each power cell that goes into the upper power port will be awarded four points. Uh, we've now started the belly up time where the, the robots are able to pick up power cells and use them. Robo Bronx are lining up. Um, over on the Red Alliance side, Team Tater is able to fire a strong volley into the outer power. Run interference to keep the Blue Alliance from scoring in there. Homework Parabotics seems to be having technical difficulties and it's stuck over on the side here. Meanwhile, Team Taters is working to gather more power cells to fire into its power port. Both the Red Alliance and the Blue Alliance have completed enough power cells into their power ports to complete stage one. Blue Alliance assaults the power with double barrage. With 30 seconds left, the teams are going to approach into the power under the power shield, where they will try to climb. That will be worth extra points during the final time. Each, each droid that is off the ground after five seconds after the batch ends will be awarded 25 points. If the shield generator is level after the 25 points, that will be an extra 15 points. Angel Bodics. Droids must score the required number of power cells to activate sections of their shield generator and then either rotate their control panel a specified number of times or position it to a specific color.